Hey everyone, welcome back. Today we're diving into the world of computer components you rarely hear about, but are crucial to your PC's smooth operation. We're talking about the Super IO chip, a tiny workhorse that can cause big headaches when it acts up. You might be thinking, why bother? It's just one tiny chip. Well, this little guy controls a surprising number of essential functions in your computer. Think of it as the unsung hero behind the scenes, making sure everything runs smoothly. But like any hero, it can have its bad days. Knowing the signs of a failing Super IO chip can save you from a world of frustration. It can help you differentiate between a minor glitch and a serious hardware issue. This knowledge empowers you to troubleshoot problems effectively or seek professional help when needed. So buckle up as we demystify the Super IO chip and equip you with the knowledge to tackle potential issues head on. Let's get started. The Super IO chip, short for Super Input Output, is a small but mighty component found on your computer's motherboard. It acts as a central hub, managing communication between your computer's processor and various peripheral devices. Think of it as a conductor, orchestrating the harmonious flow of data between your keyboard, mouse, fans, USB ports, and even the sensors that monitor your computer's temperature. Without it, your computer would be a chaotic mess of disconnected components. The Super IO chip handles a surprising number of tasks, including power management, system clock control, serial and parallel port communication, and even keyboard and mouse control. It's the unsung hero that ensures your computer boots up properly, responds to your commands, and keeps its cool under pressure. Understanding the crucial role of the Super IO chip gives you a deeper appreciation for the complexity of your computer. It also highlights why even a tiny component can have a significant impact on your overall computing experience. Now that you know what the Super IO chip does, let's talk about what happens when it starts to fail. Because it manages so many crucial functions, a malfunctioning Super IO chip can manifest in a variety of strange and frustrating ways. One of the most common symptoms is erratic fan behavior. You might notice your computer's fans spinning at full speed constantly, even when the system is idle. Conversely, the fans might not spin at all, leading to overheating issues. Another telltale sign is problems with USB or serial ports. Your mouse or keyboard might stop responding intermittently, or external drives might disconnect unexpectedly. This can be incredibly frustrating, especially if you rely on these peripherals for work or entertainment. Other symptoms include inaccurate system temperature readings, problems with sleep or hibernation modes, and even random system crashes. If you experience any of these issues, a failing Super IO chip could be the culprit. Before you panic and ship your computer off to a technician, there are a few basic troubleshooting steps you can try to rule out other potential issues. These steps are relatively simple and don't require any advanced technical expertise. First, try updating your motherboard's BIOS and chipset drivers. These updates often include bug fixes and performance improvements that can resolve issues related to the Super IO chip. You can usually find the latest drivers on your motherboard manufacturer's website. Next, check all the physical connections to your motherboard, including the power supply, fan headers, and USB ports. Make sure everything is securely connected and there are no loose cables or components. Sometimes, a simple loose connection can cause a cascade of problems that mimic a failing Super IO chip. Finally, monitor your computer's temperatures using a hardware monitoring program. Overheating can damage components, including the Super IO chip. If you notice consistently high temperatures, ensure proper airflow inside your computer case and consider reapplying thermal paste to your CPU and GPU. While the troubleshooting steps mentioned earlier can sometimes resolve Super IO chip-related issues, there are times when professional help is necessary. If you've exhausted all other options and your computer is still acting up, it's best to consult a qualified technician. For example, if you suspect a hardware failure with the Super IO chip itself, it's not something you can easily fix at home. Replacing a Super IO chip requires specialized tools and expertise, and attempting to do it yourself could further damage your motherboard. Moreover, some symptoms, like random system crashes or boot failures, can indicate more serious underlying problems that extend beyond the Super IO chip. 
a professional technician can diagnose the issue accurately and recommend the appropriate course of action, whether it's a simple repair or a more involved component replacement. Remember, seeking professional help when needed can save you time, money and potential headaches in the long run. As with most computer issues, prevention is always better than cure. While you can't entirely eliminate the risk of a super I.O. chip failure, you can take proactive steps to minimise the chances of it happening and mitigate potential problems. Regularly monitoring your computer's health is crucial. Use hardware monitoring software to keep an eye on temperatures, fan speeds and voltage levels. This allows you to identify potential issues early on before they escalate into major problems. Keeping your system clean and well ventilated is equally important. Dust accumulation can hinder airflow and lead to overheating, which can stress the Super IO chip and other components. Clean your computer's interior regularly using compressed air and ensure proper cable management for optimal airflow. Lastly, invest in a quality surge protector to safeguard your computer from power surges and spikes. These sudden voltage fluctuations can damage sensitive components including the Super I.O. chip. A good surge protector provides an extra layer of protection and can potentially extend the lifespan of your computer.